vending machine. You probably don't associate the words fresh and healthy to the snack on the go. But a nationwide company, Fresh Healthy Vending, is changing that, one healthy choice at a time. A lot of the snacks that we sell in the machines were things that we had already been giving our children. So it was just a no-brainer, actually, something that we could actually share not only with our children, but share with the community at large. Donna Walker and her husband bought the franchise Fresh Healthy Vending of Athens about a year ago. And Cornerstone Christian Academy in Norcross is one of their biggest customers. Every time I walk into that school, I love it. They're like, oh, here's the snack lady. Walker says at least once a week, she's at the school refilling the machine. But the concept of a healthy vending machine did require a little bit of an explanation. One of our seventh grade boys, you know, was so excited, you know, because we were putting in a vending machine. And so he shares, he says, oh, I'm going to get a Snickers every single day. And then the teacher said, well, I think it's actually more of a healthy vending machine. And he's like, and he looked at her and said, like a Kit Kat? So it, it just kind of shows you at times, you know, just the mindset of these children. Once the students understood the meaning of a healthy vending machine choice, it wasn't long before the machine was the talk of the school. Before we can open the machine and start loading the machine, kids come up with money and they're, they want to buy things immediately and I'll tell them, okay, well these drinks aren't cold yet and they're like, that's okay, we'll just take it as is. Childhood obesity and food allergies play a major role in how Walker chooses to stock the machine. A lot of kids have allergies, you know, um, they need things that are gluten free or nut free or wheat free and we can provide those things. So parents are happy and they're comfortable with that. We've seen a huge, huge growth as far as the percentage of children under five that have nut allergies, gluten, all those different sorts of products. And so it's really important for us to kind of think of a healthy alternative for our children. A healthy snack option now with the hope of creating healthy lifestyle choices down the road. For Gwinnett Magazine TV, I'm Jennifer Turk.